Hello and welcome. In this video, we're going to review how you can figure out your progress in class, what you've turned in and what you're missing and what your next steps are. So if you type in Sean Teaches and search that, fortunately the first site that comes up is our class site. You see the website here at sites.google.com slash site slash Sean Teaches. So if you click this, uh, you can email me by clicking this link right here or you can see all of our class files if you click Our Drive. So I'll click Our Drive. Now it depends what class you're in, but if you click Math 6, for example, if you're in the Math 6 class, you'll see a couple of options. Now let's explain what these are. So in the PSO folder, if you click this, PSO stands for Problem Solving Opportunity. And there's a couple of options here. Let's refresh the page. And here you'll see PSO 1 and 2. So these are our first two PSOs. If you click it, inside you'll see links to videos that cover these problems. You can just click these links right here if you want to catch a video that helps you solve the problem. right? So this is the video for the first one. And you can also click the PDF file here to see the problems or print them out if you lost it. Also, it's a nice little feature that I think is really cool you notice you can click the problem. So if you actually click this problem right here, it takes you to a video of that problem, right? So you just click right on it. So again, this, if you want to if you, uh, get a copy of the problem solving opportunity, or if you want a video that covers the problem, you can just click this link right here. So another folder you'll see is this, is Math 6 Resources. And if you click that, here you'll see different things, like you'll see the content we're covering or our weekly plan, and other resources in here that are just fundamental to the class will be in this folder. If you click on lessons, you can see all the lessons that we've done so far. They're numbered one per day, two, three, four, five, six, and today's lesson um, is data day where we cover um, how to find your data, how to find how you're doing. Now if you click this, you can actually see our lesson plans or the resources we've used to get a sense of either what you missed or uh, if you just want to review something in class, it's all here in the lessons folder. And the evaluations is the, the folder you would click to see exactly how you're doing. So this spreadsheet right here keeps everything you need to see uh, in order to check up on your progress. So that's what we'll go over next. So let's click this and we'll go through how to read these evaluations here. So. In the first column, there are different codes. So if you find your code, let's say your code is 9, you can look across to see how you're doing on different assignments. So, for example, this column right here has the first assignment, and it's called Factor Game. And it tells you if it's complete or not. So in this class, it's important to get at least a late complete or a complete on every single assignment. So if you see something like this where it's missing, that means you need to get it done. If you see late complete, uh, that means you got it done, it was just late. And we mark that just to know if it was late or not because that tells us a little bit about your work habits. So if it says missing, what do you do? Click the link up top. This takes you to the actual assignment. You can then print it out and complete the assignment. So right at the top of every column is a link to each assignment. So if it's missing, you have to get it done. Now with the quiz right here in this column, it's your responsibility to show or demonstrate mastery on every single quiz. So if you don't see, like if it doesn't say master next to your code, then you have to retake the quiz. And here, if you click the link, you can go right to the quiz and the resources to it, right? So, uh, so if you see, there's three levels right now. There's master, which means you really, you demonstrated mastery. Apprentice, you're kind of still working on it. And novice means there's a lot of issues that you still have to resolve with this particular quiz. Finally, you'll see here, like there's PSOs, and right now everyone has a zero. That's because we haven't graded those yet. You're turning those in. So because you're turning them in and it hasn't been graded, we have no data on there yet. But once that's updated, it'll tell you if it's complete, if it's missing, or if it's a late complete. So this is how you can always check up on your data. And we'll update this every single week, usually on a Thursday or so. All right? So that's how you check. I hope this helps. Thanks.